Hello everyone and welcome to this episode of my Ascendant Signs of the Zodiac series. In this episode I'm going to be talking about what it means if you or someone that you know has your Ascendant or Rising sign in the sign of Libra. Now to first understand what that means we have to know what is the Ascendant. This is the sign that was on the eastern horizon at the time of your birth. It is the sign that rules your first house of your birth chart and it is considered to be one of the big three in your birth chart. So we have the sun, which is identity, purpose, what gives you life. The moon, which is your subjective emotional landscape. And then we have the rising sign, which is how you interact with the world. It is the face that you put on. It's like the mask, it is the avatar, the persona. And it's really how we've learned to be coping skills, survival mechanisms that allow us to navigate the world in a way that makes us feel the most safe and secure. And that looks different for for everyone. And um, you may be a Libra rising, however, you might have certain aspects to your ascendant or planets in your ascendant, and that's going to change your first house that you'll still you'll still be a Libra rising but it will, it will make things a little bit different like if you have Saturn in the first house you will be a bit more uh, self-contained and a bit more serious if you have Neptune in the first house people might be more likely to project onto you and you might have more of a, a Piscean mysterious kind of energy although you'll still be a Libra rising so what does that mean if you are a Libra rising? Well, Libra is the sign of the scales. So that's balance, harmony, fairness. And um, it is ruled by Venus, the planet of beauty and love. And its element is air. So it's all about communication, intelligence, connectivity, observation. And it's a fixed sign, so it's fairly change resistant. It likes routine, stability, things to just be kind of like the way that they are. So what does it mean when we take that, when we put that into the first house? Well, Libra rising individuals, these are very charming people. Seem very charming, very graceful, very nice, socially aware, socially intelligent. They are able to circumnavigate situations by avoiding conflict and smoothing things over and, you know, like, really they're, the way that they interact with the world is to avoid confrontations. So we have a very, you know, peace-loving person. They... The Libra rising individual is most likely to find other people difficult actually like th despite all the social graces and the, the charm that the Libra rising person has I mean this is true and this is real they actually find they often find other people to be difficult they might run into combative people people that might intimidate them or confuse them this is because they have Aries in the seventh house. And Aries is the is ruled by Mars. So this is the planet of war. This is a very uh, competitive and feisty kind of energy to have that in the house of partnerships, the seventh house. So this is the kind of the experience that the Libra rising person has of other people often is yeah like these people can be like oh unpredictable or can uh, can make the person make the Libra rising person feel like they have to avoid trouble so this is really what they've learned it's like if I'm if I'm to go through life and and thrive I have to know how to deal with people so the Libra rising they, they know how to do that they absolutely do and um, basically, um, yeah, I would say like they, they've mastered this kind of having a, a blending in, uh, having like a very sweet image, very nice 
I think there's nothing really abrasive about them at all. Not the, the way the way that they seem. It's on the surface, like they're 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 not really going to have any kind of uh, abrasiveness or anything like that. It's just very smooth, very charming. Um, willing to compromise, yeah, definitely willing to compromise with others. This is kind of what they expect. They are good team players. They're definitely good in a team, uh, in a partnership, in a, in, in that. And uh, also, I wouldn't say that like strictly that they find other people difficult. Like it's never that simple. But they might actually enjoy this as well. It's like their experience of other people. It's like yeah, other people could be very exciting. They might draw people into their life who are exciting, who are a bit uh, more risk taking a bit more brave and a bit more full on I mean, I'm not saying the Libra Rising person isn't brave but the way that they interact with other people and situations is like they're just they're gonna take the easy road the the more tranquil path rather than ruffle anyone's feathers Libra Rising people they um, they'll look good well put together generally like the because Venus rules Libra, which is the planet of beauty, and you've got that in the Ascendant, the first house, then these people are, are, are going to look nice. They're going to probably s smile a lot, have kind of kind eyes, soft features, they you know, know how to put things together, colours and stuff like that, so it just works. And um, this is going to be to their benefit, you know, and that they might worry about a lot. And this is something that's important for them. It's, it's important. It allows them to feel safe and it's like if other people aren't charmed by this person then it's like there's a problem. Like this is how the person might feel on an unconscious level. Like if people aren't finding me charming, easy going, people take issue with anything with, about me then, then there's going to be a problem and I have to avoid that. So they are super conflict diverse. Because the Libra rising individual has cancer in the 10th house, they are generally going to be seen as pleasant, kind people, but also a bit secretive as well, because cancer on the 10th house on the midheaven is known to be a somewhat secretive sign. Even though it's warm, it's caring, cancer is very much a private sign, it's very private, so these people are often going to be known as private people, like people are going to know really with the Libra rising person, like despite, you know, the niceness and the charm and all that, there's going to be a lot of mystery around this person, the Libra rising individual knows how to keep a poker face, like, so yeah, that's about it for this video on Libra rising, if you liked it, please leave a like, please leave a comment, hit the bell icon, and I will see you in the next one, Take care, thanks for watching and bye for now.